Uh, we are talking to Gabby Dabrowski right now and catching up with what she's been up to during the quarantine time and what she's been posting on social media. I feel like you're living your best quarantine life right now. What have you been doing uh, to keep busy? I've tried to take up golf. It was put a little bit on the back burner the last couple of weeks because I started to play a little bit more tennis, but I'm putting tennis back on the back burner and golf is gonna take over soon, so. Have you been practicing a lot? Have you been keeping up your training or were you one of those players that kind of took some time off and took it a little easy? No, I said peace to tennis. I was like, <laughs> no, I, I, <laughs> I want a break. Um, it's, it's more of a mental thing than anything. I've been still keeping in shape physically, so it's not like I took everything off. I'm pretty grateful for the break in a way actually because i think it's a perfect time to kind of reset mentally also i've been tuning into your insta lives a little bit you are going on with ala tell me a little bit more about that yeah so ala kudavtseva she was starting several modules just trying to educate um you know people who want to know more about doubles and about strategy and positioning and different you know tips and tricks and she asked me if I wanted to do um, an Insta Live about doubles and we've done two of them and we've taken some questions and answered them and sometimes we get off topic, but uh, <laughs> generally um, so many people play doubles and it's, I, it's, a, it's a market that I think has been not tapped into nearly enough. I, so I think it's great even for kids to play doubles early on because it teaches them uh, better life skills than I think singles does because singles is very like individualistic, but doubles is like working on a team and figuring out the best way to win a match together. I think it's it's actually fun too. Like for me, it's social. Like I'm usually playing with one of my friends and it's like I have a buddy to talk to out there. I think so too. And it, honestly, I think it's a good balance when you can have one person that's a little bit more lighthearted and another person that can kind of put the blinders on and, and focus. You know, it's an interesting dynamic and uh, I think it keeps things <laughs> pretty fun. <laughs> no, definitely. And that's, I mean, that's one of many reasons why I love playing doubles. But I think actually we are going to take a look at some of your social videos that we've been posting Okay. <laughs> okay, all right, I here mean, we go. I also had to wait for the bird to cross because I didn't want to <laughs> hit it. <laughs> yeah, my, my friend said, perfect. I don't know how perfect it was. <laughs> uh, Gabby bloopers, this is what this is titled. I'm kind of excited to see this. <laughs> all right, so how, how much practice time went into this video though? How many takes, how much practice time? Be honest. Uh, an hour. Honestly, okay. uh, we did one afternoon, we had this hour, and then by the end of the hour, we had a couple of the dances down, but then the next morning, we needed to just refine them a little bit, and then we got our, like, you know, we, we, we nailed them at the end, but yeah. <laughs> it took a while. Combination. All right, all right, let's check out these baking skills you got. Um, <laughs> I'm appreciating this. First of all, are these yeah. peanut butter balls, by the way? Yes, so it's my grandma's recipe, and so I grew up eating them, um, you know, once in a while. It was like a huge treat, and I don't make them as well as she does, and I've made those like three times now uh, during quarantine, so I think that's like my go-to. <laughs> that's my go-to dessert. <laughs> I can't really make anything else. Oh, we got one of me? I think this is the first time I've ever watched like one of my videos on here. <laughs> A little lefty. Wow. Uh, I'm not gonna... <laughs> that was so powerful. <laughs> <laughs> the acoustics of the court kind of helped, I'm not gonna lie, but that was maybe the no. best overhead I've ever hit though. Lefty, I'll, I'll be honest, I caught it on video, but... Um, but yeah, I feel like I've, we have a few more months. I might as well add some shots to the uh, repertoire. Oh, for sure. And now I know if I lob you on that side that you'll just <laughs> get it no matter what. You can't reach me. Oh, it's fine. I'll just go lefty. No big deal. <laughs> so I, I know you're on player council right now. And with everything going on, I mean, this is really unprecedented time. There's nothing in the rule book, but you gotta be, you gotta be crazy busy with mm -hmm. that. Yeah, it's definitely been very time consuming, but um, everyone's putting in a lot of effort. Uh, I love that we like initiated this It Takes Live thing. So we have, you know, different um, professionals every day, you know, helping us through different routines. So, um, you know, we've got these all player meetings uh, Thursday night and Friday mornings. And so you can keep all the players educated about stuff that's going on. And uh, so I'm glad that they've added that in too, because I think communication with the players is really important. So everybody's kind of on the same page and they know what's going on and they're not left in the dark. 
No, and I, you know, like you, I think there's a lot of players right now that are taking advantage of this time to do some good. And right now we're celebrating with Madison Keys. She's having her Kindness Wednesday. And I think it's, you know, all these, all these initiatives are amazing right now. And this one's pretty cool. You get a chance to kind of post and tag about the things that you're doing or that other people are doing and give a little shout out and sort of spread the good vibes. Yeah, that's so awesome. What a great initiative. I mean, now especially we, we have the time I think most people have more time to think of things other than themselves. You know, where a lot of us are quarantining and that's, you know, for the benefit of other people, not necessarily ourselves. So I think that says a lot about the mindset of the world right now. And I think uh, it's, it's such a great initiative that Madison's put forward. So yeah, hashtag Kindness Wednesday. Gabby, thanks so much for coming on for this show and thanks for, for all those words. And seriously, keep up the, the good fight on the Player Council. Um, you're doing an amazing thanks. job for all of us. So, But really appreciate you coming on and chatting with me. No problem. Thanks for having me.